Here in Solothurn, Switzerland, we have long, foggy winters, so I don't get to work out as much as I would like. That's why I'm building this workout step. First, I tried to design some things in CAD using FreeCAD. Then I went down and checked to see how much extra materials I had. Didn't have enough, so I had to go to the hardware store and pick some stuff up. At the Cope, they have these uh, scrap cutoffs that they sell at a lower price, so I grabbed one of those for the top. Then for the sides, I used these 27 by 60 boards. Next, I measured all the cut positions, then opened up my new jigsaw. I hadn't used a jigsaw in a long time, so it was a little bit tricky uh, at the beginning. Finally, I figured it out and went ahead and cut all the pieces. This was the first time I've used wood glue, so as you can see it was pretty messy. I tried to wipe it off, but it didn't come off that well. And then I thought I could sand it off later, but actually never sand it off too easily either. Here I got nervous about using glue so I decided to put some screws in it, but that ended up looking pretty ugly and probably wasn't needed. But it doesn't matter because it's on the inside so nobody can see it. At the end I realized that my clamps were too short to clamp the entire length of the piece. So I ended up laying the top one sideways and just screwing it to the bottom. Finally, I sanded the whole piece. But the project's finished. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. The total cost for the materials was only about $10, 10 francs. And it took probably about three hours to build. Shouldn't take that long, I know, but uh, mainly because I only had two, actually three clamps, two that were uh, longer, one really short one. Uh, I had to wait a lot of time for the uh, pieces to, you know, the pieces of wood to glue together. Later in the evening I had the idea to put these felt pads on the bottom. I just used hot glue. Maybe later I'll get a orbital sander and go over the whole thing and sand it real well, get rid of some of the glue marks and, and stuff, and then uh, possibly put some kind of uh, sealant on it or, or some kind of coating. Okay, thanks for watching. Till next time.